while Mexico braced for round two of Hurricane Dean that pummeled the Yucatan Peninsula with Cat 5 force, NOAA.com braved the flight into the eye of the storm. The 18-hour mission started with a weather briefing at Keystone Air Force Base in Biloxi, Mississippi. Mid-level and upper-level drying, so thunderstorm activity that hasn't had a really chance to get started it kind of caps off. This is from 1 p.m. today. Shows that it still has 85 mile per hour winds and is about to, or actually may have just moved back off into the Bay of Campeche where it might intensify a little bit more. It's forecasted right now to get up to a high category two. Also, with those uh, charts, I've given you some wind charts for 24,000 and 10,000 feet, both for 00 and 6 Zulu. Dean diminished in strength. The mission, originally scheduled for 4 a.m., was pushed 12 hours to later that afternoon at the request of the National Weather Service. After flying for hours, our hurricane spotters found the eye of the storm by monitoring wind speed that came to a dead calm in the center of the eye of Hurricane Dean. Back down, come through, come through one more time, and then the last time we hit the center, we'll go out to the north, northeast and head home. What I would expect is it's gradually going to keep getting more organized as it kind of goes across the Bay of Campeche. They're talking on the intercom right now about once we clear this feeder band, we might get a better view of something here. We're still looking for the eye, but haven't found it yet. Haven't seen it on radar, and we're watching for the wind, because uh, that's ultimately that's where we, de we determine exactly where the center is. We watch the wind speed and direction as we hit the center of the storm. When we get right into the center of eye, they should go gradually dead calm. Start increasing in the other direction. Probably going to get a little bit bumpy. With 
their mission accomplished. The hurricane hunters now only have to traverse the eye of the storm three more times before heading home in time for sunrise. This is Melena Merrill with NOLA.com. A mis amigos de NOLA.com, mis ángeles de la guarda, un abrazo de corazón. Muchísimas gracias, eh.